Good morning, everybody, and welcome to the vlog. Today, we're going to be doing a reptile room tour of one of our employees here at the vlog. And we're here at Jay's reptile room with Melissa. Hey, Jay's back there, too. But this is actually his room. This is his room. This is his, this is his bed. This is your yeah. bed. Yeah, look at yeah. his bed. Wow. Dang, so you just get to hang out with reptiles all day. Yeah. Huh? I already like the aesthetic of it. Floors and everything, everything looks Comes nice. Comes together. So. Do, you, do you have time for this? We got a lot of stuff. Yeah, we got a lot of time. Day geckos? Let's just talk about these. <laughs> all right, so these are actually wild oh caught. In Florida. Why are you saying, oh my goodness? Because it's a day gecko. No, are they tame? They're chill? Yeah, look. I've never seen a chill day gecko. Me either. Oh. Boom. No Mem way. Remember yeah, at the right. reptarium? Marsh teleport. They Literally. like disappear. Yeah. <laughs> like it's not. I don't know. You got it. I can pet him? Yeah. Oh my goodness. Tell me about him. What's his, what's their name? This is Hulk, and Hulk? that's Hulk Girl. <laughs> <laughs> okay. AJ. 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 <laughs> that's a good name. And then so you caught them while? We did catch them, and they're just so cool that we uh, brought them in. Awesome. They're awesome. We're actually we're talking about maybe donating them to the rep because we want oh. people to be able to hold day geckos, and obviously yeah. every kid wants to hold geico, and you can't. That's true. We're thinking about really maybe chill. donating these. Oh, but we got to clear with AJ first. Um, yeah, that would be okay. Yeah. Well, that was cool. that was Clear. really easy. <laughs> Stop. Right here we have Branch. This is actually Nova's last. What? Really? Whatever that he had. And Nova and Lilith, they haven't bred in a little while, so. Yep, super cool. How and, old is he? A uh, little under a year, I think. To be honest, he normally is not nice. And I was actually waiting for him to frill, but maybe he's like a little intimidated by the cameras. Oh! oh. Ooh, you got some. All right. Next up, the is next up is I do not do this. favorite. Why? What do you do? Cuddle the cockroaches? Yeah, yeah. on the couch, watch his movie. He's crazy, right? Are you serious? What do you do? You like do a three hour movie with them. Really? Yeah. So why do you like the cockroaches so much? You just think they're cool pets or whatever? Yeah. You could find wild cockroaches that I like because oh, I just okay. like all insects. <laughs> I hope you guys don't find any wild cockroaches. <laughs> I was That's like, yeah, a Florida we, thing. We don't have wild cockroaches. Right, yeah. Remember, <laughs> Florida wild cockroaches. <laughs> Yeah. Florida. <laughs> Drop in the comments some names for these guys because they're male and female. They're right? Yeah, male yeah. and female. What yeah. type of cockroaches? Hissing. Hissing, Hissing, Hissing. from. Um, I don't know. Madagascar. Madagascar. Yeah. <laughs> it's in okay. the name. Okay. <laughs> and we're moving on. We got something. I got open it. This. I got it. Um, right here. I got plenty of Legos to do it. <laughs> Wrong side. What have you been teaching this kid? Okay, it's good. Bearded dragon. Now let me tell you guys something. This is an old bearded dragon. Yeah. Littlefoot is literally like 12, 13 years old now. I've had this Whoa. guy for so long. And as you can tell, he's super friendly. This guy does love to eat. Hey, AJ, he's older than you. Yeah. yeah. And it's a bearded dragon. Uh, 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 three or four years. That's pretty impressive. That's, yeah. You know what Littlefoot's from, Noah? Um, is oh, that from on. Happy Feet? Oh, my oh God. God. He's so <laughs> 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 he's Littlefoot. Yeah. I don't even know. Land before, before time, time. Dude, it's land before oh, time. Come on. Just a regular old beer dragon. So that's really it for all of my uh what I like to call normal things. Let's get into some crazy stuff. AJ you got that pickaxe? Yeah. Thanks. I love gators. Let me show you guys what I got in here. This is crazy. Don't tell me there's a gator in here. Pete! Petey! Come on, Petey! Well, we know that noise. Look at him! Here he comes. Where did you get Pete from? This is a baby American alligator. Yeah, it is. I rescued him. He actually is about six months old. And what I'm gonna do is I'm just gonna raise this guy up. He came from a situation of somebody that had him that shouldn't have had him. Basically, he gave him to me. I'm just gonna keep him for a little bit, raise him up. And then he actually is gonna go down to Gatorland with oh, the rest of our gators. Okay. So we're just keeping him here for a little bit. Just make yeah. sure he has a good life. Get him nice and big and healthy and stuff like that. Okay, that's, that's he, cool. He's so nice though, he's so good. I can't wait so, till we go back to Gatorland. We'll bring AJ. Yeah. yeah. Do a hide and seek video. Or something. Oh, I didn't seek a gator. I'm gonna win. Sounds Terrifying. like a challenge. You know this snake, Noah? Bambi. I do know Bambi. We did Wait, something. We took with her Bambi. somewhere. This yeah, is a snake that I got from dad three and a half years ago now. Really? Mm -hmm. Maybe Bambi. four years. I think she was a reptarium donation. Yeah. And it was failed because too much. Yeah, she wasn't really that nice. Is she's, she nice now? Yeah, she's pretty nice. Oh. Ooh, she's not normal so it's crazy because dad told me that she was a normal I mean, she looks like she's a head hypo like, i was gonna say she's got like a little bit of that brighter color like i don't really know morphs all that much but i was gonna say hype some type of hypo yeah, so it, i actually i think that it is hypo dad told me she was a normal I've actually it was seen that much Mimi so that told me otherwise definitely not normal no. and if you guys see aj come hold this thing's tail <laughs> <laughs> see that pink on the head there oh my goodness yeah. it's beautiful right yeah absolutely yeah and bambi's super awesome she's tame she's eating pigs rabbits i do take her out a lot of places like she's been to the art fair she's been downtown ann arbor eating ice cream she did. Mice, she actually, cream? M mice cream she went to a university of michigan football tailgating party she's absolutely Bambi. beautiful 
Yep, I love her. So this is actually, oh, this is actually one of my um favorite snakes out of like any snake at all ever in the in the world. In the world. Hey baby, how you doing, girl? Thank you. I appreciate it, Bambi. Remember, always have two people around when you're handling okay. big snakes. Cause <laughs> you never know what could happen. Responsibility. I'm gonna pass this over to Melissa. She's gonna tell you guys about this. Oh. This, this is more of her realm. Of I know what that stuff. is. What is yeah. it? Green bottle blue. Oh! oh! Get that shot right no there. No way, you're, you hold it? No. No, no, no. Oh, okay. no but get the Not shot. Not this one. Beautiful. So I got that one as an itty bitty little baby. And grew it up Raising all this way. Up. Yeah, it's How old now? I don't even, AJ? Any guesses? Like, oh, okay. just a year? Yeah. Oh, okay. Yeah, yeah, they get a lot bigger. Oh, another pink toe. Let's pinto. see. She's see if you can get her to come out. In the cork bark, right? Yeah, she She's, lives in there. She's hiding. She's she doesn't want to come out. Little pink toe. You know, I, here's the thing. I like tarantulas. I like bugs. They are a little dangerous to keep because look at how little this is. So then you're just like, what's one more? What's oh, one more? Yeah, that's true. And what's then one you more? Realize. What do you realize? You made a big mistake. <laughs> <laughs> Since we're talking about things in little. Oh, oh I see oh. it. Can you see this right yeah. there? And this came from, not that we're doing shout outs, but Chris from Garden State Tortoise. <laughs> Why? He gave you that? <laughs> he did. He looked me up and his name is Jaws. Oh, Alligator look at that. Turtle. Beautiful, right? Yeah. I love this guy. And honestly, he's actually like so good. Like he doesn't yeah. ever really snap when he's out or anything like that. I can't wait until he's like junior size or bowser size of course like that's gonna be crazy but. well you got about 50 years for bowser <laughs> yeah but you do the thing with like like snappy you know snappy where you he pets you may, them on i the know house. you gotta start now all right go ahead no you try first <laughs> i don't you can do it noah just do it noah i don't know i, I don't just I don't, start on the top of it i've never I you Never buy a snapping turtle. Just put him on the top of the head. Yeah, Let's start okay. there. You can definitely do the top of the head. Yeah. Alright, and that's the first bit of training. I think that it went good. That was nerve-wracking. This here is Dante. Noah, can you like get a flashback for the people from when we were at the Scott Smith show? What are you doing? I'm buying this right now. What? You got the cash app? Yeah. Oh, you were gonna pay 10 grand for one. I know, but this one's only 200. <laughs> Alright, David Ortiz. Yeah. Alright. Can you send it? Yeah, I did. All the lying you've done to the American people. <laughs> All right. Thank you. Yo, her name is Ginger. I'm not gonna lie to you guys. He's really not that nice. So I'm gonna hope that I don't get bit. But if he does, keep rolling. This one has an interesting story to it because we were in the parking lot of the Scott Smith show. Exactly. And, and then tell the rest. I think we were leaving or going or taking, I have no idea what we were doing. But then some guy walked up to us yeah. with this and I was like, wow, that snake is beautiful. And he was like, it's for sale. We have to get rid of it. And now here he is. And I named him Dante from one of your favorite movies. Fly, wild crocodile. Oh wait. No, that was new. <laughs> Come on, Noah. Oh, you're talking about uh. Aladdin. Dante. Thing? I know, I know. Ooh, Beauty and the Beast. No. I know. I'm that's... trying to think. It's the dancey one with. Emperor's New Groove. La, no, it's La Miranda. Literally... Yeah, no, it's literally one of your favorites. Encanto. I no. New also. That came out like. Coco. Two years ago. Oh, Coco Dante's is the dog. Coco's yeah. the kid with the. He does like I a know car. Coco. I knew the whole time. I was just Coco, messing around. Dante, he's silly acting. All right, I'm gonna let Melissa do this one. We gotta shut the door. <laughs> so this is Bushido. Really he's cool. He's actually super like tame. Honestly, one of the problems with Bushido is he's actually almost like too friendly. Like he wants to just come out, hang out with us and stuff like that. But then he decides that he's gonna not hang out with us anymore. This is my Asian water monitor. And he actually came from Nerd. He's doing great. He's, as you can tell, he's very, very tame. Very curious boy. He does like to jump a lot. Yeah. He's about a year and a half old. Okay, little guy. Yeah, he's just a young fella. He does have some pretty sharp nails. You guys, you got some pretty crazy variety. That's honestly, listen, I'm not gonna say that I have the best <laughs> reptile room. I'm not gonna say that. But something that I do like to say about my collection is like, I just have a lot of everything. You know how sometimes people are like, yeah, yeah. I have 20 ball pythons. Yeah. Like, I, I want to have a little bit of everything. I like yeah. monitors, I like snakes, I like tarantulas. Gators. You know, I love gators, yeah. Snapping turtles. <laughs> I've got we've got it all and I mean we're still just like dipping in quite a bit left to go yeah. um, But Bushido here is one of my favorites. I can't wait till he's like the size of Elvis off topic I was looking at that Dominic Hey, we bought the boa Dom's mods exotic. Oh, yeah. mods exotic his Nile monitor. Did you see it? It's no. so beautiful. No, I didn't he see was, it. He wasn't joking when he it's said blue? it's like a, it is Is it, it is. big? Oh, it's pretty big. Yeah, it's mm. like about the size chicken strip Oh, yeah, that's big. Yeah. Oh, wait, speaking of big, hold on, let me show you something. What is he gonna grab? So this right here is fudge. Believe it or not, this is my first ever reptile. When did like, you get him? Ever. 
I was like 10 or 11. Oh, oh. It's almost my age. And I mean, I <laughs> will say that. like, I love to say like, this guy is huge and I'm not trying to like get on the ball python <laughs> train of like mine is bigger. Like, no, I know he's not the biggest, but like this is a male and this is huge. Like this is a very big ball python. And he is just a normal. I just said I wanted a snake and then my right. mom showed up with this. I don't even know actually well, where he cool. came from or what she did. Thanks mom, I love it. <laughs> Your mom got you this first yep. snake when you were about 10. Yeah. Is this the start of the love of animals in this collection or? So I will say growing up, like because I was the youngest, we always had a lot of animals. Like I remember we had this gecko named Sport. Really? That, like I don't know what kind of gecko it was. I yeah. don't remember anything. I just know that it was my brother's. So I think that I was really kind of like you. I was just born into the love of reptiles mm. and I didn't really have a choice, but this is definitely what started the collection and yeah. keeping. Cause I mean, I did not think when I was 10 years old that yeah. I would be standing in this. And honestly, what I'm learning is like, it's so important to teach kids at a very young age and basically hone in on the things that they love because I mean like we just said look at what this started and I mean this here is Pink Panther and this was actually yeah. my first snake Snow White albino corn snake Ooh. or rat snake also I'm really glad I got to get this guy I didn't think I would work my way into this many animals mm -hmm. I thought he would be like one of my only animals besides a dog but then I worked my way up animals <laughs> to catching them to now owning a bunch of them which yeah, is really exactly. cool Jay's actually lying these are all AJ's. Yeah, and I you mean, just take care of them. Exactly, that's actually really. I mean, it is my room. <laughs> a couple days ago, it was Valentine's Day, and yep. I got her a great present. That is a very good it present. Is a good <laughs> it was a good present. This is Tino. This is his house. We decided to go with Tino, like Valentino, because it's Valentine's Day, but he's a male. Well, how has his temperament been since he's Honestly, been home? a lot better. Listen, he, he still isn't like super excited about doing a bunch of stuff, but most is going to take him out for you guys. <laughs> Yeah, look at him. He is chill. Yeah, he's chilling. Hey, buddy. It's yeah. okay. That's your Legos. <laughs> Melissa obviously yes. wanted a false water cobra. I did. What intrigues you about the false water cobras? Honestly, just like how they look. I like eyes. I like their big scales. Mm -hmm. That they're just a little dangerous. Yeah, Kinda little risk sense. factor <laughs> on it. I never see her in here with the bearded dragon. I never <laughs> see her in here with the frilly. I come in, she's trying to take out Dante. She's got a sheet <laughs> on her face. I think we're a little bit of the opposite. She likes the spicy mm. stuff. I like to just I like chill. Them. I like to chill. You like chill both? with him, but I deal with a lot of spicy stuff. You had to be on a desert island with one reptile in this room. What one would you choose? I mean, I'm probably gonna move around so him, cause he moves a lot. Okay, that's so smart. I'm just gonna run around a lot. And you could and he runs. you could train him to catch yeah. you like food and stuff, and then bring yeah. it back to base camp, right? You're, yeah, now unless you're he catches a rat and he eats it. Himself. That's true. So speaking of food, we're actually gonna feed a couple of things real quick. Nice. Come here, boy. He's trained on the same sound as the gator. Wow. No, and okay. he missed it. And he missed it. <laughs> All right. Oh, hey, buddy. Pete, big boy. Yeah. Whoa. Boom. <laughs> Solid. Look at that death roll right there and everything. Wow. That's great. It's good, right? Yeah. That would be cool to go <laughs> visit him at Gator Man one day. Oh, I know. It's going to be awesome. That would be cool. Can you just p picture me right now? Pete, big boy. <laughs> you ready? Yeah, cowboy. <laughs> there you go, cowboy. So we get the legacy open. Cowboy's actually gonna go to the rep. We don't have any Savannah monitors there. So as soon as legacy's open, he's actually gonna be on display at the Reptarium. Okay. Cowboy, go. Boom. Go, Cowboy, go, Cowboy, go. This is Toonchi. And Toonchi is actually a young black throat monitor. Now, this guy was a rescue. Uh, somebody reached out to me via Facebook and said that his friends had three black throat monitors wow. in an enclosure together, which what? you already know, it's just, it's not good. That's so crazy. this guy, pretty rough. He's missing a toe, he's missing an eye. He got some scratches all over his nose and stuff like that. I mean, but he is a super, super chill dude. So I'm gonna feed, oh, as he I'm goes feed this guy. It's like, cause he can't see. You can only see on one side. So when you start you moving him, he's like, eye. what the hell's yeah, happening? Right. He just like, opens his mouth. Yeah. yeah. See? I wonder if that's a black throat thing. I've only ever had waffles. Honestly, before waffles, I had never um, encountered any black throats either. Jay, have you? No, the Dad. only time that we ever went on a tour and saw black throat was waffles. Oh, and why, I, why reptile? So wait a minute. Waffles and is it, the only black throat you ever met. Yeah. Other than Toonchi. Yeah. Wow. Isn't that crazy? Toonchi, you're the second <laughs> one. He's literally just like waffles, to be honest. Yeah. He's so lazy. Like, but every now and again, He'll surprise you. In dad fashion, we're gonna see what we got here. We're going all the way. Oh, Noah, you've been going to the gym, right? 
Um, there's a home. Ah, there you go, Bushido. That's not as bad as Elvis whatsoever. How do we get him back? I don't know. Is he chill like Elvis? Yeah. You're fine, buddy. You're fine. I don't got no chicken with you. That is the coolest thing about Lil Monitors. You can do stuff like that. AJ, what do you got right here for us? This is from Lori and Brian, the BHB Hognose. Really cool. I'm so glad I got to actually get to have a hognose. Cute, right? Look at their little, yeah. little nose and cool little they face. They dig a lot, too. Their nose is like a hog because they got their name Hognose, but it's like a plow, so they dig a lot. Right, they got like a little shovel attached to their face. What made you want a hognose? I don't really know. I just really, once I got into snakes, I saw them and I thought they were cute and cool looking. And I saw how they can almost like hood up technically yeah. in a defense and act dead, which I thought is cool. So I just yeah, wanted cool. one. Freaking awesome. You got a lot of really cool stuff and some variety. So what is your plans for like your future? with everything. You still want to grow your collection? Are you rolling right now or are you telling me what you're going to say? I'm rolling. <laughs> oh. <laughs> I, thought, I thought you were just telling me. Okay, sorry. Go ahead. I'm listening now. You got a lot of really cool stuff. Yeah. What's your plan? Are you going to continue to grow? Bigger, yeah, house, bigger house. With more reptiles? Bigger yeah. house. Right now, we have a reptile room. Yes. Just a room. I'm trying to go reptile floor. Yeah. You get it? Like, yeah, I got it. The whole basement Later. something yeah maybe a whole it might be the upstairs mm. maybe an aviary maybe get a couple birds i'm trying to get mom to build an extension to the legacy of aviary she's not about it Ooh. but we have steve bashy and he's got i think dre he, he can be my Is next dre dad. his yeah. bird dre's yeah. his bird oh i like dre yeah i like <laughs> cool. i like dre so jet can you just give us a second <laughs> you guys didn't show no, <laughs> jet come on come here you can come here jet Here's the thing. I want more animals, but like I don't. On the count of three, we're all gonna say our dream animal. One, two, three. Oh. Black dragon. Oh? What's an O? And what'd you say? I said oh. All of them? Alright, all so them. there you guys have it. I don't know if we're getting anything else. Of course, I would love a black dragon. This is what we got so far, and we'll see whatever the future brings. Rocco! Oh, wait! Rocco! I, I can't do a reptile room tour without showing Rocco. Rocco, say hi. <laughs> Rocco. I think that's all that we need to check out. Speaking of out. Hope you guys enjoyed today's video. If you did, there's a playlist that you can watch all kinds of videos. You can also hit that subscription button. It would mean a lot to me. Also, hit that like button while you're down there. Have a wonderful day, Reptile Army. Remember, be kind to someone, and I promise I'll see you in the next one.